called Soul Tribe. My spiritual warriors, little earth angels. We're going to do another reading and um, welcome to my channel, Spiritual Guidance 1111. We're going to move along relatively quickly because I'm going to do what I did before. I'm going to use the entire tarot deck. We're going to have five rows of 15 cards. And there's going to be one card left over. Um, we'll, we'll flip it to see. Um, I guess that would be like the outcome card or um, Lanya, what we call it in South Louisiana. Um, or the overall feelings of this person. You can see whoever it is, whether it's going to be you or someone else. Um, read my disclaimer. It's on the description. Go to my links. I added a couple of more links. Uh, Taine is a new one I put on there. She is very gorgeous. She's uh, very talented. Look her up. Look at her her uh, YouTube channel. She's also on TikTok. I think she's all over the place. Yes. Uh, I forgot how she said. Very, very happy. I swear, she's the happiest person I've ever seen. She's... Uh, uh, hola, Vicente. That's <laughs> what she said. Hola, Vicente. <laughs> I love to hear her say that. But anyway, she's someone new I, I checked out, and, and she is legit. She's very legit. In fact, I don't do personal readings, but she does. Uh, also, Tam. Tam does. Uh, hmm, I don't know. I don't know if Mystic Beauty does. I, I think she does, but I think they all do. I, there's some that don't. There's some that don't. Me and along with others, we don't, we don't do personal readings. Uh, if you come to my camp, I'm going to do one. You know, it is what it is. Um, I do have a, a, a comment. Uh, uh, questions. Uh, I, I, I did have a comment about, uh, and I don't get in a dispute about the seasons in Israel. I don't know if they ever been to Israel, but in Israel... When, when I said about the last video, I said that the question was about, uh, oh, I can't remember, it was Jesus, and uh, anyway, but I mentioned that Jesus was most likely not born in December. Jesus was most likely born in the spring in Israel, and the spring is in, in Israel, it's between March and March, April, May. Okay, you know, this person said that, that this I was wrong in a way. They didn't come out and say I was wrong, but that's what they essentially what they said. That's fine. I respect their opinion. They said it was in December. They in the same latitude as we are within the 30 degree latitude. And uh, bad news is they're not that far north for for it to be cold. When... It, it, Google the shit. Do that. That way we can dissolve it is. I, I, I really don't get into all of that. Uh, Israel and our latitude. I think Israel is a 31. We're at 30 or 29. Something like that. So it's not that far off. It's not that far off. Um, anyway. Um, and, it, and I could care less. If everybody want to believe Jesus was born in December the 25th, have yeah, more power to him. I can't give a rat's ass. It's good. The only thing I know is this. On December the 25th, Santa Claus is coming. It's going to cost me a lot of freaking money. That's what I know. Hot dog. <laughs> anyway, we're going to do a... I'm going to pull from the... Uh, oh... Mystic Beauty's deck, Divine Headquarters Oracle. I'm going to pull five cards, and we're going to build off of those five cards. Five rows, okay? So we're going to start off with lovers. And we're going to move along fairly quickly. Blessings from God. Okay, blessings from God. Regret. Whoever this is has a lot of regrets. You see that person right there? That's an earth angel. God gave them to you. Okay. So uh, this may not be about you, soul tribe, earth angels. This may be about 
someone in your energy, your other person. And then I'm going to get me some damn comments that say, I ain't got no other person. That's not my other person. Okay. This may not be about you. This may be about not your other person. <laughs> you see how we solved that? Oh, damn it, boy. Yes, they're trapped, whoever they are. Their ass is hemmed up. Yes, and guess what? Ooh. Ooh. Not good, not good. They're in poverty. Yes. They might be in line to get an EBT card. Yep. Bad poverty. They might not even give them that. I don't know. But, ooh, they, but what I'm saying is they're going to need some help. That's what that car says. Oh, okay. And we're gonna move along. The next one we're gonna be going with um, is uh, uh, the uh, light sears. The light sears. That's the next deck we're gonna be doing. And we're gonna just use Tyra. The next, the next cards we're going to be turning is all Tyra. Ooh, the fool, fool, first card up, zero in Tara. That's the first, the first card in Tara. The fool. I don't normally read just one card because, but it lands on top of lover. So this person wants to start a, a journey with you. Uh, they want to, uh, I think they want to approach you maybe. Because the last card was poverty. I believe they in they they hurting. They need some help. Maybe. Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands. In the reverse. Seven of Wands in the reverse. Hmm. This person is exhausted. Yes, this person is, is worn down, worn out. They weren't out fighting. Like I said, they they hurting. They they need help. They so they 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 overwhelmed with with. Uh, they have a lot of self doubt. Mm. They have lost their confidence. Mm -hmm. Death change. Change. Whoever this is, whether it's you or I don't think it's you. I'm not getting that. It's not you. It's someone else. This is someone else. They need to change, but they don't want to. I think they resist change. They don't want to change. Mm -mm. No, they need to end what they're doing because they 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 going down the wrong road. They're headed toward a cliff. They may have already went over the damn cliff. That's why they're in the situation they're in. They falling, falling fast, and they can't stop the fall. They ain't enough for they ain't enough work for them to do to stop the fall. And you possibly couldn't help them if you wanted to. Because they got they they I think you asked this person to stop. Tower in the upright. You see, this person has created themselves a tower. My God. I think you, you you told this person, stop, change, stop what you're doing in the cycle that you that you've done this before. I think that's your exact words. You've done this before and you're doing it again. Why are you doing this? Don't do this. You were perhaps you you they you you are someone I think it's you. You had them on a spiritual path. They were close to a spiritual path. Maybe they weren't perfectly on it, but you you had them close to it. And the Queen of Pentacles. Like I said, we're going to move along relatively quickly with this. Uh, Queen of Pentacles. That's just you in the upright. Queen of Pentacles in the upright is you, a spiritual warrior, soul tribe. You are a nurturing person. You are... You, you gave this person, whoever this is, practical support. When I say practical support, that means you, you practically supported everything they had. Whatever that need was, you, you provided it. Was it if it was emotional, uh, physical, whatever the case was, financial, you gave support for that. 
You were there for them, whatever they needed. Emotional, you was there. And you are the star. Yes, you are. You are the star. You, to this person, To this person, you are the hope. You are the calm that they needed, the peace that they need. You are that that uh, mm. you 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 are the spiritual purpose in their life. They come to you. You are the light that they come to when when things get dark for them or when they get their ass in too deep. They they reach towards you. Not someone else. They they putting their hand out towards you because they know that you're gonna grab that hand and you're gonna pull them to safety. Yes, you. They were in your circle of safety. They that you would not let nobody touch them. Mm -mm. And they 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 walked away from your your circle. And they they whatever safety you provided, whatever that was, and, and it was. All aspects, like I said before, financial safety, um, emotional safety, physical, spiritual safety. You you provided that for that person, and they moved on. They they didn't want that no more because they wanted something different, or perhaps they wanted that and something different. And you would not negotiate with that. You would not compromise and say no, no. If you want that, go there. And that person, that's one of them that said, well, okay, I'm gonna move on for me. Wish you blessings and happiness. I hope you can find that shit. But you knew this whole time things was going to start coming apart at the seams. Mm, goes. Mm -hmm. The two of wands. The two of wands. Mm. This person has a lack of planning. They're reckless. They don't plan ahead. They thought they did. They thought that they had made plans ahead for the moves that they were making. The game that they played, they thought that they had planned every move accordingly. I'm going to move here. He's going to move or she's going to move there. I'm going to do this and they are going to do this. In the, the game of life, chest. Yes. And you like. Hmm. If their world up, you you was you did not play the game the way they thought you was. You like totally. Mm -hmm. Whatever they did to try to trigger you didn't work. Nothing triggers you. You you are emotionally balanced. You emotionally under control. You do not get shook up. You you are pentacled up. Nothing bothers you. It's cool. That, that's what you want to do. It's going to hurt me. And, and it did. It did. It hurt you immensely. But if that's what you, you cannot make someone love you. Oh, King of Cups. Let me show you this. King of Cups in the reverse. Ooh, you can't make someone love you. This is the one of the coldest cards in the deck. Cold. King of Cups in reverse. This, this some bitch is cold. Like, they're like a damn iceberg. The, the coldest person you're going to ever meet say some of the most vile things to do to you that could ever be said. Maybe post things that you cannot believe, but nothing triggered you. You, you. you let it be. You let them say whatever they had to say. And if they wanted to move on, you help them. Go ahead, boo. Mm -hmm. Go have fun. And let's see how long that shit lasts. And you sat over here in your pentacled up palace. And you let them live their life. You, what you did, you took all of the shit they threw at you and you built walls around yourself and you set up in your, in your tower that is nice and safe, that didn't fall. And you're smiling. Mm -hmm. Ooh, let's see what's next. Page of Cups, they want to send you a message. Page of Cups wants to send you a message about being overburdened. Their ass is burdened up to the max. I'm talking about that poor donkey right there. Their knees are bending. They, they so, it's so heavy. They can't deal with it no more. Mm -hmm. King of Pentacles. That's you. Just like I just said, you pentacled up. Yeah. They, they, want, they want to talk to you. Because they know 
that you pentacled up. They know that. See, this person don't want you. They need you. That's a big difference there. Just like I said a while ago, you can't make a person love you. You can love them immensely. I'm talking about like adore the shit out of them. But you can't make them love you. No. And they don't. They didn't. They didn't care. They cold as hell. They didn't care. They didn't. They did zero choices or decisions they made involved you. It was all them or their friends, their toxic karmic fruitcake friends. And now they know they made a mistake. They know they made a mistake big time. Yes, because someone else done done picked that that fruit up. So they throw that fruit out of the whatever, push that fruit away. You earth angel. Let's use the earth angel. They push that earth angel away from them. Somebody else done picked that earth angel up. Said, "Hey, I'll take them. Mm -hmm. I'll take them. Knight of Wands. Knight of Wands. Mm -hmm. In the upright. Hmm." Just like I said earlier, Knight of Wands is a passion, passion card. Wands is passion. Knight of Wands, they very, they reckless, they impulsive, they charming. Now they charming as hell. Probably very, very beautiful. I'm talking drop dead beautiful. Mm -hmm. But with this old cowboy, I'm gonna tell you right now, I pick loyalty over beauty every day of the week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when I used to buy a horse, I didn't always buy the the most beautiful horse that was out there in the pen. I didn't go to Silbon and look at the most beautiful horse that was out there. I went in there and I started looking at the horses and I wanted the calm horse. The horse that I I didn't have to break a sweat chasing the son of a bitch to catch him to ride. I wanted that horse to come to me. That's the one I bought. It could have been like the, some big headed Roman nose horse. But it was the best horse I ever had because I ain't had to run him down or, or play him out to be able to catch and ride him. Yeah, that horse come to me. That was my friend. My horse came to me. That's what my point is. People are like that. I would rather love someone that is loyal to me than someone else may not like me. But I think that's the most beautiful person in the world because they're loyal. They got a beautiful heart, a beautiful inside. They, another person may be painted up from the floor, up, got war paint on from hell. Shit, got makeup on, look good as hell too. Got their hair all curled. Mm hmm Yeah. But you can put makeup on the devil too, horse. I'm going to tell you that. And that devil look good. God dog it. So you get in bed, but then you wake up the next morning. She just cries. Be like, damn, girl, what happened? <laughs> what happened between? Oh, no. Uh-uh. Be like, I ain't never drinking tequila again. <laughs> Ace of Cups. Yes, indeed. Ace of Cups in the reverse. This person is an emotional wreck. But they hide it. They hide it well. They only, they, they, they have anxiety to the hilt. They are, like I said, an emotional wreck. Queen of Wands. In the upright. They are, they think they are. Put it this way. What they wanted was independence, and they got it. They got independence, but now, but they want it all. They want independence. They want to be in the Queen of Wands and have, um, the king of, of pentacles. They want they want they want it all. They don't want the the they don't want the boundaries that comes with the king of, of pentacles. They want it, they want in the no strings attached. Mm -mm, I can do what I want. Yeah. Ain't life a bitch, cause it ain't like that. No, well not with this whole cowboy, it ain't and I'm sure it ain't with with with, with all the you know, with all the soul tribe and, and, and my spiritual warriors, you know. I got a sign in my living room. My house, my rules. Bet your ass on that. Mm -hmm. Don't like it? You get to the end of the dry, driveway, take a right or left. It's going to take you back to the highway. And we happy. I'm happy. <laughs> I'll be smiling. That's way by when you're leaving. <laughs> See you later. Welcome, <laughs> <Falcon> deals. <laughs> 
We're going on for the next one. Blessings from God. That's the one where he's holding that earth angel and he's saying, look what I got for you. Boo. Look what I got for you. Yes, indeed. Five of swords in the reverse. Ooh, five of swords in the reverse. Uh, damn. I got a feeling they lost that. Yeah, they did. Yeah, because it says past resentment. Mm -hmm. They're cutting their losses. Mm -hmm. They want to make amends. The five of swords in reverse is they want to make amends for what they've done. Okay, this person wronged you. I can tell you that right now. This person wronged you. Big dumb. They know they did too. You were too good to them for them to do what they did. And they know that. They're cutting their losses and they want to they 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 want to seek forgiveness. And they don't even have to ask. But what they want out of this is may not be what you want because the five of swords is reconciliation and it's there there may not be no reconciliation with this. This may be in uh, you know, I forgive you, but we we I'm good like it is. I am, I'm per because you don't trust this person. You will never trust this person again. Mm -mm. Ever. Some things people do, they, you cannot fix. You cannot say, well, I'm sorry, it's fine. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you are. And I forgive you. But are we going back to where we were? No, heaven, heaven. that's a hard damn no. Oh, hell no. Oh, you put a sword in my back, three swords, walked on me, I mean, just betrayed me, moved out of the way and let somebody else take a swipe at me? No. Maybe you took a swipe too? Hell no. That's what I'm saying. Soul Tribe, is that's what happened. Now, there's some of y'all out there, I know that there is, that's going to want this. They're going to want to reconcile and restore whatever they had. They'd be like, you know, because they like, I love this person. I want this person back. Yeah, well, and there's others within the soul tribe that say, yeah, I love this person and I always will. But I'm going to love them from a distance. They, they ain't getting in range of me again. Ever. I will never. I should have listened. There's only two things, there's, there's only two options with this. Either they should have proved everybody wrong and not done what they did, or you should have listened to what everybody said. I wish they would have picked the other option and proved everybody wrong, but they didn't. You know, they didn't. They did what they did to you. Ooh, let's see what this one is. The Empress in reverse. The Empress in reverse. Mm. Whew, this is a selfish individual. Super selfish. Yes. Empress in reverse. All four queens in reverse. Ooh, low vibe and anxiety. Super promiscuous. Ooh. Hot. Oh, my goodness. They like overwhelmed. Lack of focus. There's a lot. There's a lot with the. Empress in reverse. Uh, the four of wands in the upright. Mm -hmm. This person wanted freedom. This person wanted freedom. They, they went towards something that they thought was happiness. They, they went towards something that they thought was going to bring them joy. Um, you know, they, they just, uh, freedom and possibly marriage. Yeah. Uh, the, the four of wands in the upright is, 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 can be the twin, the twin flame. Possibly somebody told them that they were that twin. Or they told them that they were that twin. Yes. I'm your twin. I love you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They're like, oops. That was a mistake. The chariot in reverse. Yes. Mm. Mm. 
carry it in reverse. This person, they have no self-discipline. They have no, they have a lack of direction. They don't know where they're going. No control. None. They have lost the control to everything. They have lost control to towards the where they went. Whatever that was. Person, place, a thing. Third party. Sil the H is silent. Third. H is silent. And the, the I is replaced with a U. Third party. T-H-U-R-D. H is silent. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But what, you, you can say fruitcake loud. Fruitcakes. Yeah. Nut jobs. Mm. Psychos. Yeah, they are. They went towards that. That's what you soul tribe, you ain't never gonna understand it. You'd be like, what in the hell is chariot in reverse? Mm -mm. You're like, what in the this person is arrogant and careless. They don't care. They're reckless. I said that in this row right here. They're reckless as hell. The three of wands in reverse. Three of wands in reverse. Again, lack of planning. Yes. Instead of looking at the big picture, just, just look at the small picture. They look at like what's happening right then and there. Like they don't care about what's going to around the curve. They don't care. They're just coming into that curve doing 120 miles an hour. Hooked up, hoss. <laughs> Got their foot on the floor and let's roll. They don't, they don't care how, you know, how sharp the curve is. They don't care. They, they, don't get in the car with them. That's all I'm going to tell you. Is don't get in the damn car with them. Show, Lord have mercy. Yeah. And they, they, they constantly stuck in. And that's what I'm, I was saying earlier about this. You, you, you know, this person, you could have told him, get out of that cycle. You're repeating a cycle. You are cyclic. Why are you doing this? Don't do this. You cannot deal with this. You're going to cause yourself all kind of misery. You know, because you're going to bail out. You're out of that. Shh. I would have too. I would have got my ass out of that situation like a long time ago. I'd been like, whoa. Yeah. I'm jumping. Grab my life jacket. Be like, I'm a, I'm a boat captain, y'all. I hope y'all can drive this one a bit because I'm out of here. <laughs> Queen of Swords in the reverse. Oh, this person is like overly emotional. When you, they get overly emotional, they're very deceitful. They lie. Swords. Words. When they talk, they talk in the fucking tongue. They fucking tongue. <laughs> you can't be like, damn. They cold hearted again. This is a cold hearted son of a bitch. My golly. Be like, what the hell, bro? Be like, damn, dude. Why you gotta be so cold? Yeah. Cold hearted. They cruel. They better. Why? All oh, that you done for this person. What the hell are they? Why are they, are they like that towards you? That's part of it that you don't understand. You're like, you've been there for this person, not just for like short term. You've been for, there for this person practically their whole life. Every time they came to you, even when you didn't, they didn't ask. That's all they had to do was say that they needed something and you was there. Mm -hmm. You didn't, they didn't have to ask. You did it for them. Narrow-minded assholes. Whew. I'm starting to sweat. I'm getting so aggravated. <laughs> the emperor. Yes, the emperor. In the upright. That's you. That's you, soul tribe, spiritual arts. My little, little earth angels. You are a leader. And you land on top of the queen of swords. Mm -hmm. You are a leader. You got stability. You have security. You are, you have, you set boundaries. You have rules. And if they break the rules, then you, you like unasked the situation. You, and you are all the kings combined. You, you are the top dog. You are boss daddy. And they don't like that. I'm going to tell you that right now. They do not like that. They do not like your, your, character they don't like the way you are they like what you can do but everything else you can keep that they just want what you can do for them and if this person ever approaches you you have to be warned about that this they in it 
for a reason. No other. They do not love you. They do not care. They showed you that already. They have shown you this many a times. The world in reverse. It lands on top of emperor. Perhaps at one time you wanted personal closure because it's landed on top of the emperor. Perhaps at one time you wanted personal closure. You wanted, you wanted this person to come to you so that y'all could figure things out. Perhaps now you don't care. Mm -mm, I'm good. We closed and you're happy. You are very happy. The Ten of Cups in the upright. This landed right. The, the emperor is you. The world in reverse is you. And the Ten of Cups is you. Yes, you are very happy the way things are. You know, you, in fact, I doubt seriously there's going to be some that this don't resonate with, but there, there, uh, there are a majority, there's some of you that are going to say, I am perfectly happy the way things are. You can stay where you at. Stay over there with that fruitcake. Mm -hmm. Whatever they, whoever they are, you don't care. You don't want to know. You don't really want to know. You, you could care less. You just hope that they're happy where they went. Because they weren't happy with you. You weren't enough. You didn't do enough. Mm -hmm. King of Wands. King of Passion. In reverse. This person is impulsive and ruthless. Be careful. I'm telling you. High expectations. Yeah, they got... Yeah. Again, they're unpredictable. When they, when they, they set themselves up with un, unreachable expectations, they, goals, okay, and, and they use people to try to get to those goals, which they never can do. That's why they become disappointed, depressed, and all other things that they are. Temperance, earth angel, that's you. Temperance, earth angel, you are balanced. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Very, very patient person. You don't get no. Sh you don't get shook up. Three of Cups. I gotta guess what that is. Mm -mm -mm. Three of Cups. And you and they under judgments because of the Three of Cups, because of what they did, where they went, and who they with, and what happened, and the reason it took place. The pain involved, the pain that they put you through. Now, they're going to try to flip the script. But God don't play negotiations. God don't negotiate. He don't, not with us. No. There's only a couple of people in Scripture that God negotiated with. He don't negotiate. He won't with us. I can tell you that right now. No. You hurt one of his earth angels, you're going to pay a price. And it's going to cost you. Now, you can't pray your way out of that. You can't pray. You can't pray for karma to deflect or or or. Uh, uh. <laughs> it ain't gonna happen. Karma's coming. You probably already there. That's why all of this shit is going on right here. Justice, on top of judgment. See, you've been judged. Now justice is there. Karma is there. You have been found guilty. Spiritual guilt. For hurting one of God's chosen, which is you, spiritual warrior, soul tribe, my earth angels, they hurt you. Their ass is in a bond. Mm -hmm. Their ass is in a bond. This is the last card on this row. This is the last card on this row right here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, indeed. Wheel of fortune in reverse. No control. Zero control. Regret. Mm -mm -mm. Regret. <clears throat> Regret. 
That's the, the card we're going to build on. That's the next one. Yeah, you wanted them to break that cycle. They didn't. They, they would not. I think it's because they had influences that were stronger than yours. They had others that were influencing them, that their influence. I'm going to tell you this. Sin is fun. I don't care what people say. Sin is fun. It is it, it, for a certain amount of time, just for a, a season, okay, you can get away with a lot. But sin is, the penalty for what you do is so painful that when it comes later, it's unbelievable. The Five of Cups. Yeah. And that lands on top of regret. The Five of Cups is... Of course, three cups are spilt, two cups is left. This person is at a loss. They have lost. They, again, they, they're full of sorrow and grief. They don't always show it, though. Maybe one of their friends may know, a couple of their friends may know, but this is not something that they, they show. They put a mask on. It's something that, uh, yeah, mm-mm-mm. They put a mask on. King of Swords in reverse. King of Swords in reverse. They are. They are illogically weak. They. They want to manipulate, and that's what's causing all of the problems that they have. They're careless. They, they play mind games. They misuse people. They abuse people. That's what this is. The king, of, the king of swords in reverse abuses the power that they have. And with you, it's the emotional power. They, they gaslight. They breadcrumb. They manipulate. It's all, all of those things. The ten of swords. The Ten of Swords. Yes, it's a painful ending. This person, this this was, and it was very painful for you. Very, very painful. You could not believe what had happened. Them deeps, them, them, them wounds went so deep in you that, that you won't ever, ever let whoever did that to you get close to you again. You had family do less than what this person done. You had family that has done less to you and they have never, you will never speak to them again. So can you imagine with this person? Hmm. Yeah. Queen of Cups in the upright. Yes. Queen of Cups in the upright. Ten of Swords. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Happy memories. Reminiscing. I believe the Queen of Cups is like a nurturing, uh, emotionally nurturing person. Um, hmm. Following this Ten of Swords, this could be someone, I'm, I'm taking it that I'm taking it that this is the Ten of Swords is you. You, you were extremely hurt, betrayed. I'm not saying that this person ain't betrayed. They, they may have been betrayed by whoever this fruitcake cycle is that they went towards. They may have. Who cares? You don't really don't give a damn one way or the other. You don't wish it on them, but you don't really care one way or the other. That's what they chose. But the Queen of Cups is, is you. And you through this entire process, you've been healing. And you heal very quickly. You have, you have moved on. The Six of Cups is next. The Six of Cups is next. You have moved on really fast. Yes. You, uh... Mm -hmm. You are emotionally stable now. Uh, maybe at one time you weren't. Maybe at one time you, you, you were... 
you and then you went towards the Hierophant. You went towards the spiritual side of things. You seek spiritualism instead of secular. You went spiritual. And and the outcome from that it is a lot better for you. Was a lot better for you. Then they went towards the three D secular side of things, and uh, I don't think that it paid off for them. I do not believe that. The nine of wands. Yes. I think this is them. They are very very battle weary. They are. They have been fighting ever since they pushed you away. Ever since that. They pushed you. Once they pushed you away, you was you had enough. You said, "Okay, I'm good. I'm done. Yeah, we won't ever do this again." And they have been battling ever since. Ever since then, they have fought. That it has been a uphill battle for them. You have the nine of wands and the eight of wands back to back. Yes. Mm -hmm. And the two of swords in the reverse. Yes. Uh, I think the eight the eight of wands, the nine of wands is they they are protecting themselves. They are battle weary. They still holding their, their wand, they still holding their staff, and they will fight if you come towards them. That's them, not you. And you are battle weary too, undoubtedly, but you, you're not in the same energy as they are. They have they are they are tired. They are exhausted. You remember? They are exhausted. And uh, I think they want to move towards you. They want to move towards safety. But they don't know how you're going to accept that if, if they did. And they're trying to pick between the two of, you see, this the two of, of swords is they're trying to pick between the lesser of two evils. And their mind if they walk away from where they went and they come towards you, where they went ain't gonna want them back. You can you can stay over there where you're going. And in your mind, you you don't trust them. Because they already put some swords in your back and you're like, mm, I don't I don't believe. I'm good. I'm I'm you know, I'm I'm okay. Yeah. And mm -mm -mm. four of swords. Forces. In the upright. Mm -mm. You just want to. No, that's them. They want to come towards you. They want rest and relaxation. They know with you they're going to find peace and relaxation. They know that they're going to find some some degree but the problem with this person is they won't give up where they at and and stick with you they want both they want you and they want where they at whoever that is their friends or whatever and with you that ain't gonna happen end of story we can we can we can shred this card because that ain't gonna happen you don't want no part of it simple as that knight of cups in the upright mm -mm -mm. They want to follow their heart. Now they want to. Now they want to follow their heart. See? Mm -hmm. They want to make an approach and they want to propose to you something and they want to. Uh, don't trust them. Love is in reverse. Love is in reverse. Don't trust them. There's an agenda behind. There's a there's a motive to this person's madness. And, and it's just exactly what it is. And they've always had that. You didn't know it at first. Everyone else around you knew but you. Because you were blinded by love. You, you were blinded by the love that you felt for this person. Mm -hmm. This person thinks they're going to win no matter what. Six of Wands. This person thinks they're going to win regardless. Nine of Swords. Mm -mm -mm. This person has so many secrets. And they worry. 
to solve. Deep-seated, deep-seated fears this person is carrying goes way back. Knight of Swords in the reverse, restless. They they don't they don't get a hold. They got zero direction. They're very unpredictable. They 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 have a disregard for the consequences that comes along with bad choices. Yes. They make some terrible choices, and and then they they try to outrun the consequences, in reverse. King of Swords. I mean Knight of Swords. I'm sorry, Knight of Swords. Page of Swords in reverse. Deception, manipulation. This person has not changed, not one bit. You can listen to me. You can even let them back. They all talk. They're gonna shoot you a lot of bullshit. That's nothing but illusion. They're going to sell you a damn dream that'll turn into a freaking nightmare. Straight up. And you can, I mean, that's up to you. I, I'm just saying. I'm not giving you advice. I'm just telling you. And the next one we're going under is trapped. Imagine this. Trapped. In reverse. Eight of Swords. Self-limiting beliefs. They do not. That ass is. Yes. They want to. They, they feel trapped. And the only way they know how to. Get out of the trap that they're in. Is to come towards you. And to seek forgiveness. And they think that if you accept them back in your circle. That is going to damper or to give them some type of protection of the karma that they're they're dealing with now and that's all that's going to do is karma's going to eat your ass up too mm -hmm. for accepting whatever they did wrong and whatever and not forgiving accepting there's a big difference there you forgive what they did but i don't accept shit that they did no no you shouldn't either no don't ever accept what what went on mm -mm. No, boo. See that right now? Karma gonna come after you too if you, you allow them back. And you, because when you accept them, you accept the consequences that come with them. When you accept them, you pay for the consequences that that they accumulated. Hmm. Ace of Wands. In reverse. Mm -hmm. This person has a they have zero energy, lack of energy. Ace of, of Wands is passion. They have lack of passion too. Whatever they went towards, if if they were fulfilling their intimate side of their their thrill, their fantasy, they don't do it no more. If they a dude, his wand ain't working no more. If it's a chick, she ain't had a freaking her toes curl in a long time. You probably was the last person that curled their toes. Imagine that. And they left your, your tur toe curling <laughs> thrill to go somewhere else. And they ain't got nothing out of it. Nothing. Unbelievable. Okay. We don't want to get no more graphic than that. Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups. Mm. You were a wish come true for this person. That's what the Nine of Cups is. You were an emotional wish come true. Not only emotional, you were a wish come true in, in every aspect, physical, financially, and spiritual. You filled, you checked off every box this person had. And they walked away from, imagine that, boy. Yeah. Eight of cups. I'm sorry, I covered up the cup. Eight of cups. Mm -hmm. And the upright. Eight of Cups in the upright. I think this is for you. I think this is for you. They were a disappointment in, in all aspects. Just like you were a, a wish come true, they were a disappointment in every as, aspect. Physically, financially, spiritually, uh, emotionally. You name it, they were a disappointment. 
in every freaking aspect, and you still love that person. You say, I'm going to give them a chance. They'll get better. They'll learn. We can all learn. And you tried to teach them, but that wasn't a good one. Seven of Cups in the upright. Mm. They think about you all the time. They think about you all the time. I think you think about them too. I really do. I think you think about them. But the way you think about them and the way they think about you is two different things. See, they think about all of the good that you brought into their lives. And you think about all of the bad, the illusions and all of the bad dreams, the nightmares that, that they brought to you. The struggles that you took on for them that they never helped you with. You took all that shit on and they laughed about it. They thought it was funny. That's how I, I think. You disconnected from this person big time. And you don't want no part of it. Four of cups. See? You're like, no, nah, I'm good. <laughs> you're sitting there and you're like, no, nah, I'm thinking about this. I, I'm like, no, nah, no, I'm good. I'm, I'm, I think I'm fine. Financial laws, five of pentacles. This person, this person just, they, they hurting. I'm telling you. The cards don't bullshit. They, you, this this person is in in severe. They they looking for strength. They looking for, in in. They looking for positive influence. And with everything, they're looking for positive. They're looking for strength. In they're looking to focus. They they can't focus, and they need someone to help them focus. And on everything, especially finances, because finances is eating them up right now. And they can say what they want. They wear a mask. But finances are tearing them up. Uh, and that's just part of the issue. That's not all of it. The moon and the upright. A lot of secrets. This person is nothing but they got, possibly you know some of them. You know, you found out some of them. And they worry about it too. They worry about what you know. They worry about if they come to you and they don't tell the whole story, what you know already, that's going to exacerbate the situation. And you'll be like, really? Yeah. And in your mind, you're going to be saying, well, you're not telling me the whole story, boo. My love. You are like omitting a lot. Yes, that's just, just part of what you your ass has been up to. Mm hmm. Tell me the whole story. Yes, five of wands. Yes. Conflict. They want to. They want to. They want to end the the conflict that you and this person, whoever, that, whatever this is going on, they want it to. They want to end it. They want to stop it. They want to send page of wands. They want to send you a, a message or or they want someone to relay the message for them. But this is going to be some, this is going to be bad news. It's going to be, mm -hmm. because the magician follows it. This is not going to be, and then the Knight of Pentacles follows that. It's not going to be something that, uh, you are the magician. You have the, the page of wands in the reverse and they, they bringing you a message, a message of passion. I need this. And you are the magician. You are you have all of the tools available to help this person. And the Knight of Pentacles. Okay? You you are in the Knight of Pentacles. And you work hard. You're very productive. You you are extremely responsible. So instead of you, you believe and you invest and you, you watch financial growth within you. And you're going to send a message back to them. Page of Pentacles. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. Yes. Oof. Yeah, the message back to them is going to be 
I'm good where I'm at. I am diligent. I manifest what I need. I have financial opportunity. I am in the Ten of Pentacles and go elsewhere to find some help. That's what that's going. That's what that is going to be. The last one is poverty. Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords. This betrayal, deception, theft. That's all I can say, in my opinion, is. Be very careful. Be very careful with this person. They hurt you before, they're going to hurt you again. Nine of Pentacles. You are a very, you plant your seeds and you reap the harvest of what you plant. You don't take from nobody, you mind your business. You, you just one of those type of people and you have financial independence. You don't need nobody. You want people. You don't need them. Those that are in your life, they're in your life for a reason. They don't just arbitrarily show up and you like accept them. No. Nine of Pentacles. The devil. Mm-hmm. This person is in a devil energy and they are, I don't think that they'll ever get out of a devil energy. They put on a mask, they play like they're religious, they play like they, they may even play like they're spiritual. I can tell you they are around others that are spiritually dark. They are not of the light. They are, they make as if they are, but they are not. They, and it, I like when they come up against me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm your huckleberry shit. I would, let's play. <laughs> shit, yeah. Hell yeah. That's this person. They, they, they possibly, uh, the devil is an addiction card. They possibly addicted to drugs or alcohol or whatnot, whatever the case is. Sex, you name it. Gambling. There's a bunch of addictions they could be addicted to. Um, they can't deal with this temptation at all. Temptation is one of the things that they cannot deal with. Very codependent and they very materialistic. materialistic. They um, ace of swords in the upright. Yeah, yeah. They want a new beginning. They want a. They want to. They, they, this is this card is what one of the the cards that we was talking about. They want to tell you that they want. A new beginning. They want to start over. The hangman. The hangman again is they want to let go of the past. They want they don't want to talk about nothing that happened. They really don't. They want to start with a blank piece of paper, a blank slate, and move on from there. The problem with that is you know all about the past. You part of the past. So how are you gonna start over? Explain to me that. How are you going to just drop all of that and like, oh okay. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. that you forgiveness doesn't include forget. Whoever tells you that, that if that you have, oh, if you pay a therapist and they tell you that, they're fraud, son of bitches. They ain't worth for them. The hangman. Next one is four pentacles. The four pentacles. This person is holding on to what they got. They ain't cutting loose four pentacles in the traditional tire. They got two of them under their feet. They're holding one and one of them's on top of their head. Mm -hmm. They're standing on what they have. They're trying to make all, all they're trying to hold on to the little bit that they have. And they're thinking about what they need. Four pentacles. And you, in that scenario, they need you. Three of swords. This person either got their heart broke or definitely broke your heart. Definitely, that's a, that's a that's a that's a sure thing. They put three swords in your heart, but I think that this fruitcake that they run, they went towards whoever it is, friends, whatever the case is. 
I personally believe that they got involved in an intimate relationship and they got their heart smoked. Smoked. Yes. They, they, they ain't got enough thread to stitch up the shit that that fruitcake did to them. Eight of Pentacles. <clears throat> uh, eight of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. Eight of Pentacles is next. Two of Pentacles. Two of Pentacles. The reason I know it's like eight of pentacles is because it flipped too. <laughs> it flipped. It flipped. Out. It was accident. Yeah. Mm -mm. Yes. Two of pentacles. We all know what the two of pentacles is. They juggling. They trying. If it's dealing with pentacles, it's um, they juggling. Robbing Peter to pay Paul. They juggling finances. And they, they, they go end up dropping something. Like I said, they went over a cliff and I don't think they going to come out of that cliff. I think they, they fall in fast, big time, and they, they need you. If it's a relationship, then they juggling relationships. You were part of it, probably. I don't know. Maybe you look bail out of that. You're like, okay, good, good deal. The next one is the eight of, they're trying to work hard. They are working hard to try to, uh, they are diligent at what they do. I'm going to tell you this. They're most likely good at what they do. The, whatever they do, they're good at. They work very hard. They have high standards in their job. Very talented. Is that enough? No. No. Because they, they, they're fiscal irresponsible. They don't know how to control themselves. They don't know how to control themselves. High priestess is next. Intuition, yes. This is this person in the upright. Mm -hmm. I think you're the high priestess. I think that you are the high priestess, and they want to approach you with a two of cups following. Yes, they want to approach you with the Two of Cups following. This person ain't giving up. I think they want to make you an offer. I think they, and, and like I said, it's up to you, and you, you have to be very, very frugal with them. You have to be, vet them very well. Yes. Seven of Pentacles. Hmm. You plant the seeds. Yes, you planted some seeds. You you give a lot of forethought to whatever is going on. And uh the three of pentacles in reverse. This person is nothing but misalignment. They 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 I don't know how to put it. Uh three of in reverse, they kind of like they want to be part of the team, but they want the accolades of teamwork, meaning they want the recognition, but they don't give none to the team. Let me put it that way. That's what this card is. Uh, uh, the sun in reverse. Again, this person has a lot of secrets. They're, they they trying to hide things. They're very careless. They, they arrogant, and what the sun in reverse is, it could be clouds obscuring the sun. They're they not allowing things to, what they think. The problem with it is they don't know what you know, and that, that is like driving them crazy. They wish that they knew what you know. And the hermit is the last card on this room. In the poverty rule. Uh, in reverse. This person is possibly lonely. They are lonely. They, they uh, withdrawn. They are not happy. Uh, mm -mm. 
And the last card off of the Divine Headquarters is a Healing Heart. That's the one I said that was going to be the last one. The Healing Heart. And the last card in the Tower is the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. And the Ace of Pentacles in reverse is, is a lost opportunity card. They had more than more than ample time, more than ample opportunities to get this right. And they didn't. They lost it. They missed the chances that you gave them, whatever the case was. And they they lost it. They didn't plan. They had zero foresight in what was going on. And I'm going to look at my information device. And um, let's see. Oh, this is what I want to see. Paranormal activity. Wanted to know, can you help? I will find, answer a question, please. Will I find the help? Will I find the help? I need to get this divorce. And is my sister going to get away with what she's doing to my mother and me? Okay, well, let's. I have a card deck that is, uh, is, is going to ask the Holy Spirit. Huh. This is a maybe. Maybe. Uh, this has to do with your sister. Maybe. Could be that she's going to get, a, get away with everything. Are you going to find the help you need with your divorce? Yes. Both cards. This card came out as a maybe. This this card came out as a yes. And the yes is it's it's the icing on the cake and all the sprinkles too. You are going to be satisfied. I believe that's what the Holy Spirit says. And uh, the other one is just a maybe. Maybe your sister may. And it was a leaning. And when the card said. Maybe it was a leaning on no. So, that being said, paranormal, I hope that I answered that question. Let's go to the next one. Madeline. Madeline sent me a long, long comment. And I love it. Thank you, Madeline, for the comment. It was about... Um, um, what I said about Mary Magdalene and Jesus. Um, uh, nowheres. Throughout my entire life. To, throughout my entire life. I believe that Jesus loved Mary Magdalene. Ever since I first heard the story about them too. I believe that. And I believe that Mary Magdalene adored Christ. Nowheres, not one time have I ever insinuated that Christ and her had sex. I don't know where you heard that from, but it didn't come out of my, my mouth. Never. And my mind didn't go there. Yours went there, obviously, but mine didn't. You can love someone and not have sex with them. I think you can, Madeline. Can't you? I'm just saying. Christ loved his disciples big time, big time. He loved his disciples. He loved every one of us. I love you. I ain't, we will never have sex, you and I, ever. I love my entire soul tribe. Now, you could dispute me all day long. You can dispute me and I... I doesn't matter to me one way or the other. I don't really care. But I don't like when somebody says something that I didn't say. I never said it. I never insinuated. And I don't believe it. I never believed that Christ and Mary Magdalene had sex. I don't think they had children. I don't think none of that. Do I think that they loved one another? Absolutely. She adored that man. Yeah, you know how I know? She went visit his grave just like a person that would love someone else do. They would go to their grave because they missed them. Just like I would go to a friend's grave. 
even if she was a female. If she was a female and she passed away and she was my best friend, I would go to her grave because I missed them. Doesn't mean that we had sex. It just means that I love that person. So, and I'm only addressing this. Thank you for the well wishes, Madeline, towards my daughter. I appreciate the prayers that you offered to her. I, uh, I do, uh, I do appreciate the comment about that. And uh, this is by no means uh, something between you and I. This, perhaps, it was my fault, and I, I gave the wrong impression when I, when I proposed the comment. I mean, the the uh, on on the video, what I said. Maybe maybe others got it, uh, misunderstood me also, but I I don't I don't believe that. So you know we we can we can agree on that. You and I, I promise you that I love Jesus uh, and uh, I would never put him in a position of of insinuating that he fell into sin. Uh, God loves each and every one of us. Y'all talk to him. He misses you. Uh, as often as you can. I miss you. And I love you. Peace out.